Hello guys, this is Saurabh or in this video I am going to show you how to use Mixin, Include and Extend. So that's very simple. So I am going to create here class. You will see there is my HTML code, Heading, Content and Media, right? So let's create a H1, H1 Heading, right? Create a class here and font size is something 30px and uh, color of font is red right here and now i'm going to create another class right and this will affect uh, with h1 heading right i'm going to paste this one here right now you will see that one is one h1 heading it will take some time okay h1 heading h1 heading and now you will see okay right here right so you need to use here semicolon right because we are going to use here sas right so you will see that one is h1 heading right here now i'm going to use here basic class and basic and that's my class here and here border my basic class border is something solid and uh, 1px right here now you will see i just want to inherit the h1 heading properties to my basic class right so how can i do this so that's very simple so i'm going to use here first uh, i'm going to arrange this border right so with this something 50px right like that right i'm going to use here 100px if i want to use this class properties in my basic class so I'm going to use here extend word keyword so at the rate extend and uh, here your class name is h1 heading and you need to use here dot also with some seconds to write you will see I already have inherit my h1 heading properties to my basic class right so that's very simple example to use accent so now uh, how to use mixin and where to use mixin this is also using for inherit the class properties right so how can i do this so that's very simple if i use uh, like i'm going to use uh, create one more class here so medium right and here i want to make some content like font size and color is similar right so i'm going to create another class that's name is font basic and uh, here property is like same and if i just want to add one more thing like font weight right font weight is something 500 for my h1 heading and if i want to use here h1 medium so i'm going to use here font weight something is 700 right i'm going to use here so what should i have to do i'm going to use here medium right so what should i have to do here i'm going to use medium mix in m i x i n mix in and uh, create here function font basic and i'm going to use here creating the variables so dollar sign and font w and here font weight is dollar font w so we are going to inherit the font weight properties dynamically in our css right so uh, here we will see there is nothing right now so i'm going to use here include to inherit the properties of font right so here at the rate include and uh, my class name is font basic right basic and their function name and there if i'm going to remove this function in first right uh, okay his function so i should use here font medium is 500 right and i'm going to remove this here from there 
right and now uh, okay there is h1 medium right you will see here you will see option h1 medium our we inherit the properties of this font size and color and if i want to inherit the font weight like there is 500 right you can assign this value to anything like if i want to inherit the properties of this font size color and font weight is different so i don't need to create the another class for that right so i'm going to use here simple include font basic and assign the font weight is 700 and now you will see his font weight is 700 like this so that's very simple to use mix in and include include so why we use mix in so that's very simple example if you want to make the uh, dynamic values and if you want to access the dynamic values in your css so you should use mix in right to passing the values or if you want to make simple inherit the class so you should use extend to inherit the properties of another class right so if you have any doubt you can ask me on comments thank you so much for watching this video please like my video and subscribe my channel Thank you.